Hey y'all, hope everybody's doing well as you can in y'all's Night of the Woods. My name is Josh, this is the Lesson Home Place, and just gonna do a little short video. I uh, guess I'm gonna see an ice update maybe, see where the ice is at. You can tell, so there's the house, you can tell there's the bank, there's old rooster dog. <laughs> and let me flip this camera around, let me back it out, there we go. So there's the lake, it's all froze over. And I was coming out to check the ice, the depth. I know you can tell, probably can't, but we got a probably good 10 inches of ice already We're on the lake right here. There's my spud. I was just took ice bud and trying to see what the depth was. So, but anyway, when you open up the water, I mean, the least thing you could do is to get your fishy bowl and try to catch a fishy. So, see if I can do this with a camera. Of course the train's gonna come out when I'm recording. Let's see if I can do it one-handed. Let's see, get down in there. This is a glow bait, y'all. I don't know if you can tell. We can kinda see how that these are wicked. Glow baits are the way to go. Let a little line out. I'm gonna see if I can do this one-handed. See if we can get one on uh camera do not know you can see it down in there oh yeah you can see it see my bait down there that's what's cool about ice fishing i love about it these glow baits you can sit there and watch your bait and you can watch it just disappear when a fish gets it so let me see see what happens what you think about it, rooster huh you don't know about it Let's see. There he is. Look at oh, oh, oh. Look at that on camera, y'all. Check that out. Oh yeah. That the rooster's looking at it like, what in the world is that? That is an Arctic grayling. Let's see if I can get this out of him. Come buddy. I might put y'all down if I can get the hook out. Nope, oh, there we go, awesome. These are real pretty fish, y'all, look at that. This is a little guy, he might be probably 10, 10 inches, 10 and a half. Real pretty fish, though. I'm gonna let him go, let him get a little bit bigger. Well, we have these guys, and we have, uh, if you've seen previous videos, uh, rainbow trout in here. So anyway, that's a blessing, I'll take that. Come here, buddy. Go back down. There he goes. So anyway, y'all, I'd bring you fishing, just a little uh, fishy clip, catch a fish. That's pretty. That's a blessing. And yeah, it's nice and warm out. It was what negative 17 yesterday, and now it's 12 above. So this is nice. You see, I got my gloves on. This is nice out here. So anyway, say hi to YouTube Land Rooster. Rooster, tell the folks hi. Oh well. <laughs> so anyway, y'all go go fishing, y'all. It's a good way to get uh, put some. I uh, cannot stress enough putting uh, meat in the freezer. It's super super simple to do. I'm gonna do a video on start to finish for beginners. Um. So, but anyway, y'all. I think that's it. Y'all take care. God bless. Thanks for watching. In the end. Hey right, y'all. This is uh my new boom stick. This is a Browning X Bolt stainless stalker, and it's chambered in. 375 H&H &H Magnum. This one is not playing around. If there is a boogity bear or a bull moose with an attitude, this will give them an attitude adjustment. Uh, this was one I've been wanting to get on and off thinking about it and finally found a good deal on it. So I decided to pull the trigger on one. It's got iron sights on it, which is what I really loved about it for close up encountered uh, contact. And we need to try it out. So I bought this a couple days ago. And I have yet to try this out, so y'all get to see the punishment my shoulder may or may not feel. We'll see. I'm optimistic. So we need to see how the recoil of this thing is. So y'all get to experience it with me. So, I guess let's go and try and see what it does, right? Alright, y'all. I got one 300 grain 
375 at H&H in the mag. I said in my thumb and my glove, you can see how big that joker is. I ain't playing around. So, whoo, let's see. Uh, biggest raffle I've ever shot. So, we're going to see. I'm going to brace for this one. Ready? Honestly, is not as bad as I thought it was, God. I swear on everything. You know you shoot something, but it's not that bad. So, anyway, I'm woken up now. Let's go do something. <laughs> Good. Okay, y'all. So, I thought, why not shoot it again, right? I do have some new and other kind of round. Now, this is something I would really want to hunt with. These are uh, Federal Premium Bear Claws. These are 250 grain. They're a little lighter, and they're smoking fast. So, it's like, we'll see the difference between... The 300 grain and these 250s. We'll see what the, the recoil, if it feels any any different. So, let's see. Here we go. <laughs> Honestly, I don't know if y'all tell. I could shoot, I could shoot this a lot. I, 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 I swear on everything. It's way less than what I thought it was going to be. It's actually pretty sweet. Uh, so, yeah. So, tell me what you think. How do you feel like the new uh, elephant gun, per se? It's pretty much an elephant gun. <laughs> All right. So, y'all, uh, th thanks for uh, checking out the new gun. Hope you liked it. Let me know what you think. <laughs> Catch y'all later.